I think how, okay, what do you think about how we met? That's just not even really that interesting. Well, what do you want to talk about then? I think we should talk about cheating. No, I'm not cheating either. I really don't know. I don't care whatever you want to talk about. I think you should read my DMs. Here. Here. Read my DMs. Pass up acá. Read my DMs. Here. Read my DMs. Oh, you smell good. What is that? Pineapple and honey. Idiot! I'm saying you smell good, not the drink. Look it. Ruben made a drink because you guys requested that he drink because he's always quiet. But that's kind of, I'm gonna become an alcoholic here. No, me was it alcoholico? Well, every time I do a video, I'm gonna have to drink, and next thing you know, I'm gonna become an alcoholic. Hey, hey everyone. everyone, welcome back to another Ex Murillo video. Don't forget to subscribe, post your notifications, and hit the like so button. So today what we're going to be talking about is um, a topic that was brought up a lot, and it was about cheating. No, you didn't say it like that earlier. What did you I said, say? How, how come men cheat? That's what you got rolling down. But the board. topic is about cheating. Yes, but it's just not all men. I, yeah, why men cheat that's and what women got. stay? That's what that's what I I wanted to talk about because. But it's not. But just it's just you see that's what you don't understand. It's not about just women. I mean, it's not just about men cheating. There's a lot of women that cheat too. And I remember when I was I was single. When I was single, I met a lot of women that were married and had boyfriends, and they would still go out and be with guys. I'm not saying be with me, but be with guys and shit. Because you go along with that. With what? With being with a girl that has a husband or a girl or a boyfriend. Because how would you know? How would you know? How would I know what? How would you know? <laughs> how would I know what? How would you know that they had a man? Well, because some of what? Well, because they, <laughs> they, they, they would say they had a man, boyfriend. And you would still talk to them? <laughs> You know what? No, I wouldn't talk to him. All right. You know what? I would talk to him, I think. I talked to a few of them that were married, I guess, yeah. So, so you see, it's oh not just all God, men. Women cheat too. I didn't even know this. So you see what I mean? No, when I'm I just saying, this was, was before, this was before my, this was like before. Before what? Before, when I was single, I didn't do what I was with you. No, but still, the your things that you keep on doing. So you're saying that if a woman's single, I mean, it's a woman's married, I didn't, that is not cheating on her boyfriend or husband? Oh my God. So uh, this conversation and you guys, I got Ruben a drink because you guys complained that he doesn't talk. So everybody noticed that when we did our last video, him drinking kind of loosened him up. So he got a drink. So. I wanted to talk about something really serious because on my DMs, it was really sad for me to see. <clears throat> it was really sad for me to see your stories. Like, I was really sad to see how how men. And I'm not saying that it's just men. Like, I clearly get it. Like, I understand that women do it too. I, you know, I, I've met men where they've told me, oh, you know, my girl cheated or whatever. Like, but the. But the higher rate is men that no. do it. Okay, I understand. But a man only gets as far as when a woman wants to get. So, I mean, so so I can come on to you and say, hey, you got a number. And if you don't give me your number, then I'm not going to be able to get to you. Yeah, but. The, so if you give me your number, es porque quieres pedo también. But my thing is that what I'm trying to tell you guys is like, I was, I'm so sad. Like when I read all these stories that you guys are telling me. Like, oh, my man did, you know, my man, I, I was pregnant and my man cheated too. Like, that just makes me really sad to know that you guys are going through all this hurt and just know that you guys are going to be okay. Like, 
that if everybody else got out of this bad situation and I did and like my and mom I or did. whatever, you did what? Got out of the situation. What situation? I know you're not talking about me. What? How? What? No, I'm not talking about you. I got out of. You get out of situations too, and you get. What I'm saying is that if you're in a bad situation and you're you're going through some some shit, what you gotta do is just go ahead and just, you know, things will get better for you. Like you will start forgetting the feelings won't be there no more. I mean, you'll be hurt for the first however long it takes. But you overcome all that. Really? Who were you hurt by? Huh? Who was I hurt by? Yeah. I've been hurt a lot of times. No. But you know what? I'm still here. Look. See? So basically, like, I, I wish I just had a magic wand to just, like, take all your guys' pain away. Like, I've been trying to go through my messages, but I also work, so it's really hard for me to get to my messages. Why do men cheat? Why do men... Why do they not care to get caught and lose their family? And cheat. No, well, look, it's just like I said earlier, Marbella, it's vice versa. It's not just the men. It's a lot of women out there doing the same thing, and they don't care about their losing their 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 uh, their um, their families or kids. You know, if they get caught by their husband, it, it works both ways. So it's not just the way your topic is coming. Is men cheat? Why do men cheat? Why don't no. you just put why do people cheat? Okay. Or sorry, why do yes. humans cheat? Okay. But, and I do understand that some women cheat too. I just said that earlier. I just, just didn't say that men. Okay, the way my sentence came out, I apologize, you, your master. No, I'm not saying that. I'm just saying that you, I mean, but let's I'm, just try to keep it. Because there's a lot of good men out there too. There's a lot there of good is. men. And there's a lot of good women too. Don't get but me wrong. But I didn't get no messages from men saying, why did my wife cheat on me or why did my girl cheat on me? Because uh, you know why? Because men have pride and they'll be like, if I go out there and tell her that, then they'll be like, you fucking idiot. That's bien pendejo, te pusieron los cuernos a la... So, of course, he's not going to want to look dumb. They got too much pride. I, so, we want to know why, for example, like, why, why, would, why did you ever cheat? Why did I ever cheat? Yeah, why did you ever I cheat? I never cheated on you. Dude, let's not even go there. I never did. Yes, you did. Marbella, when you catch somebody cheating on you, you can't go... You, where did you get that stupid line from? What? From that stupid line that you're trying to get right now. Which one? That you're trying to say that I have to catch you on bed in order for you to be count, uh, counted for cheating. That, yeah. Ruben, she would call me and tell me what you... And, and, and this is not even about you and me. I'm just saying, like, using that as an example. Like, why do men cheat? Like, if you have a wife or a girl that you live with, why do you cheat? What do you mean, what I... I never cheated. Okay, the only thing that you're saying is... <laughs> you motherfucker, okay, I'm using so you I as an say, example. Okay, so I can say right now, I can sit here and say, you know what? Now I need a drink after this. I'm going to say, you know what? I can sit there and say, you know what? I'm going to... um. I'm going to call some somebody up right now and tell them that. Just... Make some shit up or what? No, 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 no. You got to take responsibility and like, uh, my question is, why do men, like, you cannot, I, I can't say why do men and women cheat because you're not a woman. Why do women cheat? I've never cheated, but, but I want to say okay, that. Okay, do you have any friends or anybody that you I, know I, yes, that ever cheated? Yes, I did cheated? know somebody that did cheat. And, and it was she a female? Yes. Okay. And the reason why I felt that she would cheat on her on her man because they weren't married but they were living together was because she wasn't happy with him. Oh, that's a very good fucking reason there. She wasn't happy but she was scared to leave. And that's what I'm... How does that work? I don't know. I'm not that person. Well, I don't understand that. Like, but that's what I'm saying. Why, why? I, don't, I think that if you feel... That you're not happy in a relationship before you go out there and do something like that. I think you should just let them know it's not working out between me and you and just move. Oh yeah, like you did, like you did that. What? Like you ever let me know all those twenty times that I caught you? Why didn't you ever let me know that you weren't happy? Cause obviously, that's why you cheated. You're just saying that. You're admitting to it. Well, why I want to know why do men cheat? And it's not really pointing the finger at you because honestly, like, I am over it even though you guys think that I'm not or whatever. Like, it doesn't really have anything to do with me and Ruben, but we're, we're, no, it don't. we'll use it as an example. Yeah, we're using it as an example, example because supposedly 
she's a victim <coughs> of cheating, of me cheating, and I'm a victim of me being accused of cheating. <laughs> the, 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 Whatever, like he, he's conniving, he's conniving. This is a perfect example how it's all working in, how men lie. You could catch a man cheating and you could find... De D dude, you're a motherfucker. So, let's say me and you are together, you're my man again, we're living together, whatever. And I get a message. Right. Okay, it's a guy. You see the message, hey babe, what are you doing? Let's meet up tonight. That's an example. Okay. Because you're trying to say that a message and a girl telling me is different from me catching you. So because I never caught you in bed with a girl, to you it doesn't count. That's good. Then let's just get back together. Me and you. Let's get back together. Let's start living together. And then let us let me do that then. Let me have fun the way you used to have fun. What do you mean? What kind of fun are you talking about? Well, let's just say that right now a guy texts me and told me, Hey babe, like what are you doing? Let's meet up tonight. And me and you live together. So that that doesn't count as cheating? Because he just texts me and you read that. But you haven't caught me in bed. Well, I don't know. I just... No! 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 What do you mean you don't know? Answer my fucking question. Answer it. You're gonna turn me into an alcoholic. You're getting me heated. No. Okay. What? Well, look. No. Wait. You never answered my questions neither. The other. The questions about why do women cheat? Well, I. I'm assuming because they're not happy, or or maybe because they just like to fuck around. Those are the. But be honest, because you men or not all men like don't take it like that. I'm not saying I know there's good men out there somewhere under a rock or something, but but I'm just saying. Be sincere. Why do men cheat? Why why is it that they can't just be with one woman and 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 that's it? And I'm not saying all men because I know there's good men out there. No, there's a lot of good men out there. And my dad and him are not one of them. Dude, tú ni levantes la mano. Tú no te cuentes con eso, okay? Don't even fucking count yourself. That's what I said because you guys are like. Um, like wondering what I'm saying in Spanish, but no, okay. The thing about so cheating, let's talk about okay, let's get back to the thing. The thing about cheating is that I think a man, a woman, I mean, a man gets let's see what as is, close as a woman. If I ask a woman for a number and she's okay, I'm and gonna answer that to question. You want me to answer that question? Like, why didn't because why look, didn't... you. As a couple, as a marriage, I think we get too comfortable. We get too comfortable. Okay, now we're talking, now you're We're answering. getting too comfortable to the person that we're next to. And it's true what she said earlier. It's true. We get so used to that person. We get used to that person being around us all the time. So we are a little scared to go. But there's no... There's no... Uh, there's There's might be love, but there's no... Um, like, there's no more things that could keep it going and stuff. Okay, you know? I think I know what you're trying to say. You're trying to say that you get, or that men get bored. That's what you're trying to say. But you're just trying to use, you're trying to word it different. So you're trying to say he, what he's trying to say, right? Or no? Because that's what it sounds like you're trying to say. That you get, to, you get too comfortable, but it sounds like you're saying that. No, you get used to the person that you're around But don't you think day. too, like, you're, you and get you're bored? And you get comfortable, and there probably is, like, you know. Like all boring, like. <clears throat> I, I mean, not boring, it's just like, you know, I don't know. I, I'm probably thinking, like, you know, maybe spice some, some something up, you know. Get home one day, and my girl's in some lingerie or some shit, and you know, look, you know. I don't oh, know. Or get home and like there's food ready and stuff like that and no no that's bullshit because a girl a woman can and, and I'm not trying to make this about us because it's not about us it's th these are questions that people asked us okay so we're using you as an example because you're a whore so yeah so you know perfect example right here like why. To me, it just seems like you guys get bored. Like you're bored and you want something new. That's what it sounds like to me. And you just don't want to be a man and answer the question right. 
What, what do you mean? I don't understand. Like, oh, like, for instance, like, oh, I'm bored of her. Like, you're bored of me. Oh, so then it was, let me go, like, you go out and you meet a girl and then another and another. And why? Then why be in this committed relationship if you can't just be with one person? Well, that's the same thing I say. I mean, I don't know. Why be in a commitment or why do take those things to to that level and get married or be with somebody like that if you don't want to, if you're not ready to settle down? Are you ready to settle down? Uh, so, anyway. I am. <laughs> oh, yes. You are? I am. I am really am. I'm ready to settle down now. So are you going to settle down with your girl? Hey! You're trying to avoid the question. Is this the other game we're playing or what? I had a question to ask you that I didn't ask you. That was supposed to be good. It was too late now. Can I ask you that question? No, <laughs> we're talking about a topic right now that's really serious and it really it, 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 it really bothers a lot of people why people so cheat. I just feel like why do people cheat seriously I, feel I think like that's what it comes down to I mean it comes down to you get too comfortable to that person you start but what bothers me that you're saying is that if I didn't catch you in bed with the girl or kissing her or whatever the right. question is you're trying to tell me that that doesn't count as you cheating so let's just say that me and you are together and I get that text, like I said, answer my damn question. Mm -hmm. So me and you are together right now. And I get a message. And right, that guy's okay. like, hey babe, what are you doing? Let's meet up later. So you're not going to get mad because I got that message. Well, you're not you going to question these days, me. These days people call each other babes. I, I hear this all the time. Like, 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 you know, guys be like, hi. Or, and they'll be like, hi babe. I swear I'm serious. This shit goes really goes down. I'm like, what the fuck? Back together then. That's gonna be so awesome. So maybe he's probably like I could have you and then I could have Sancho on the side. Cause if that's well, you're you see, girls do cheat then. No, cause you're a you're fucking liar. You don't want to take shit. responsibility. You don't want to take responsibility. You're already thinking about doing that. You want to. You, you know what? He's a liar. There. When we used to be, when we used to be together, he was really jealous. He was a really jealous guy. So he's a liar. That's bullshit. He's trying to get no, out. No, I used to be a really jealous guy. I used to, I used to really think about that. But then I started thinking. I started thinking. I'm like, you know what? Maybe. I mean, why do I gotta be jealous if I know what I have at home or why? Yeah, I have a dumbass at home that's just waiting for me, and then she's not gonna go nowhere. So why? Why am I tripping? Well, because I never thought that way. I just thought that I never thought that about you neither, and I didn't think about that and about nobody. So else. basically, but I never cheated though. First of all, so yes, you did. Yes, you fucking did. So many times, a lot. I caught you so many times with different. And it's not that I'm okay. I want to address something like because I don't even want to talk about us, but I just want to address something like I know everybody's like. You're so bothered about him cheating. Yes, you guys, I am bothered about Ruben cheating on me because the reason why I left him was because he was a cheater. And I always dreamed of stay with the person that I had kids with. I dreamed of staying with that person forever and, and growing old with that person. Like I, want, like, I had kids with you, even though, you know, like, that was Fajita or whatever. <laughs> And I had kids with him and I wanted to grow old with him like you know when you're old and you see those couples out there and like They need a cup of water like for him to be like, you know, like Vieja, you know does, You're fucking sick today. Like here's a cup of water like but he fucked it up. No Bullshit, I used to always be there for you every time you used to go somewhere I used to always go with you Every time you used to feel like something, I want this, I want that, even when we were not even together. No, but that's not what I'm trying to address is when that you, got pregnant you guys, some of you guys are mad. Like, some of you guys are mad saying that, oh, it's sad how she just can't just let it go and move on. No, like, okay. I forgave him and that's the reason why we're friends because I forgave him. I forgave him. Okay, and we're tell like me this. When friends. she was pregnant from Gordo, oh my God. when she was pregnant from Dream. Gordo, 
You know who she would call when she would crave something? Who would you call? Ghostbusters. Na, 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 na. Who would you call? Who would you call? You called me once and you offered. No, I didn't you offer. Told me. Yes, she you called did. me and she told me. No, he's a liar. He called me one time and he's like. Se me toca una. I no, was how was I gonna do this? No, from cheesecake from Danny. I don't even like pumpkin pie. One time cheesecake he, called, he would Denny. call me when I was at work and he would be like, ¿Qué se te antoja? Like, what do you want me to Because he knew how I was. And then he's like, You know, this turned into you and me, and this was about the whole cheating thing. But I just no, want to go back to that right now. But I just want to address something. Like, you guys have to, you guys need to understand, like, you know, who wants to have a child with some guy and not, and not, and, and not work it out? Nobody does. Like, we all want to work out our relationship with that person. But, you know, Ruben's cheating habits, like, one, another, another, another. And I love him, like, as my best friend. I could, him and I could never work things out. There's just no way. Like, no, there's we too are much good damage. Friends, we are there's good too, da too much damage. And, uh, you know I know what? too much of his dirt. There's no way. Like, would, how can you guys stay with somebody that has hurt you that much and not have dignity for yourself? There's just no way that Ruben and I could, like, I wouldn't be able to ever work things out with him. But I have love for him a lot. And how we learn to be buddies and be, like, because we always fight, huh? Like, yeah, nah. we, You see, this is like, we always get into little arguments. This, this is like real. Heads. This thing, like, no, this But you know no what? Fate. At the end, we always end up coming together and, and making things right. You know, be for the simple fact that she is a good friend of mine. She's been there for me and i've been there for her too yeah we both have she's been there for me and like i know you guys probably think like you guys should just get back together it's not like that no more it's not like that it's not the same it's not like that and i know you guys probably be saying oh you still like her or she still likes me no we we yeah we do care about each other because you know we've been knowing it's a friend so you're trying it's to a say you want to get back with me yeah yeah, I, no, because I don't see her like that. I don't see don't her you like that. Don't ever respond to me like that. I don't see no, her we like don't. that no we more. No, we don't. We just like, yeah, like I think too much damage has been done between us. Like way too much damage. And like, Ruben just made me realize that he's not, I want the total opposite of what Ruben is. Like I do not want to be with anybody that's like Ruben. What? I what want, the fuck? What? I want to find me a good guy that will be like, this is what I want in a guy. I am looking for a guy, and if I can't find that guy, then that's fine. And I'm not looking for a perfect man, because there's no perfect woman, there's no perfect man. I'm well no, aware of that. Un a la verga. No, no quiero un ángel, pero tampoco quiero un pinche demonio. So I want the opposite of you. So I want me a guy that could be like, you know what, babe, let's go to church on Sundays. Like, on Sundays, we could go to church, because I... Have like my faith is with God like to me God comes first to me Jesus Christ is everything to me So I want to go to church on Sundays and Saturday You know Friday maybe like hey, let's go to like happy hour Let's go have you know a drink or two and like you know because you need alone time to unwind whatever Saturday could be family day Sunday also That's like and I want me a good guy like I want a guy that knows what they want and that wants to have a future and that doesn't want to be messing around cheating and lying because i cannot stand lies like we're too old for lies you know what okay let's get back down to the cheating thing right the only thing we have to say about the cheating thing is if you don't like that person don't hurt that person it's better to just let that person know vice versa a girl or a man a woman or a man you know if it's time for you guys if you guys the love is not there the the is yeah. that the way you think now? Because that's not the way you used to think before. What? You never used to think like that before. No, well, but I, mean, I, I, I grow. I, I I'm think you grown. Grew up now. I grew okay. up. I grew yeah, up. That's I'm a good. Grown man. That is yeah. good. And uh, before you guys hurt each other, it's better just to let that person know, you know what, I don't love you that way no more. I care about you. But I don't, or whatever, whatever you feel like saying at that moment and telling that person to, to break it off in a good way and be friends with that person or your baby's dad or whatever or your baby's mom. I think that would be the best thing to do before you go out there and get into another relationship, relationship or try to cheat on them or, or anything else. I, that's, the, that's my advice to you guys because, you know, people do get hurt out there and 
guys and women get hurt and and it, it, it scars you for life it scars the other person for life you know what i mean it, it could scar you if you get cheated on and if you cheated on somebody it could scar that person too and, and it, it won't ever be the same no more it will never be the same no more it won't never you won't you know so just my advice to you guys you guys just so break it off before you guys do anything like that, if you don't I like that, per like if you that don't like that person day. no more, you don't feel like that I for that person, and you know, and like she said it, like she said it before, she goes, "There's a point in your life where you know when you don't like that. How do you know when you don't like that person? When because that person I, I, gives you a kiss and you what? Mm -hmm. Like you're just there like you irritated go. with you're that person. Irritated. And you know like you, you don't <laughs> have to stay with that person just because you have kids. Like that's another you thing don't. I want to point out. Like I know because a lot of your, you, a lot of, a lot of you girls that DM'd me and like they DM you too, huh? Yeah, some of them. But it's just like, um, I stay because of the kids. Like really you guys like when the kids get old they just leave and like i i get it no like, and it's not even just about the kids don't do it for the kids if you're not happy don't do it for no, the kids also, because you know what the kids or maybe i mean there's a lot of stuff if you think that you guys are still in love and you don't know what's going on because there's a lot of people that feel confused they're like i don't know if i love them but then again, I don't... Like, they don't know why they stay. But That's basically what everybody yeah, says. Like, I don't then, know why I still stay. I think then, you're you know scared what? to let go. No, but it's you know not you're not about happy. Go. But maybe there is something be, be going on between that. But they got counseling, though. You guys could go to counseling. You guys could do a lot of stuff that you guys... You guys could look at our YouTube videos and <laughs> subscribe. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. And then they'll want one of... They'll be like, oh my God, now I know why. <laughs> yeah. I'm just kidding. And now but I you know, know why she left her, but I'm just saying, like, why do men cheat? I feel like um, I wanted to open up to this because I feel like he's making a point, and like whether we like it or not, I whether we like it or not, I wanted to get his input on it, and I feel like he's trying to say, and and it's okay, like I'm not mad at you because you're saying that, like we want to know us as women. We want to know why you guys do this. Why do we do it? We don't know why we do. Why do men cheat? I don't know. Why do women cheat? I don't know. It just I happens like at the moment. You guys are I mean, bored, like it might said. be a little bit of alcohol involved. It or might you're be bored. you're bored, or maybe sometimes or you, you just, just feel like this. Shit. Or maybe you just want to get at this person, or maybe you just want to be sneaky and see if you could get away with it. I don't know. A lot of people you get the, the, rush, the adrenaline, or you you know, there's a lot of there's a lot of things that could go through your mind mm -hmm. at I'm that. Gonna stay safe there's a lot, there's a lot of things that go through your mind. When you would you call when you do stuff like that, but you know what? At the end of the day, you're hurting somebody. You're always hurting your kids if you got kids with that person because you know it takes two parents to raise a family. But I also think that a lot of guys, girls don't leave like us as women don't leave that person that we're not happy with. Like we're not happy with that person and we don't want to be with that person. But we don't leave because of the kids because we don't want to bring. Because what's going to happen sooner or later, you guys, you break up with your partner. And then you go out, you're going to eventually go out, you're going to meet somebody. And then, we don't want to bring just any guy to our kids. You know, nowadays you can't trust either a guy or a girl. A girl could just come, if you're a guy, a girl could just come and like want to beat your kids for anything. Or a guy could come and abuse your daughter or hit your son or whatever. And I think that that's why us women put up with the men because we do it for our kids mm -hmm. and men don't think about their family first bottom line i just wanted to point that out why why you ain't pointing nothing out because we i stayed with you all that time because of the kids and you don't even appreciate it and i was no, so unhappy look, with you because there's a lot of men that have their kids with them i know like i know I'm a couple serious. of guys too. i know a lot I of do. guys that raise their kids and their 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 wives leave them it's never a dull moment that I just want to fucking see. There's a lot of men that raise. And there's a lot of kids today, these days, and I ask them. I'm like, well, who do you live with? I live with my dad. Well, where's your mom at? I don't know. She left. I ain't seen her since. And we got a, uh, like, we, we got on one of our videos, our prior videos that we did, some girl, like, because I do read your, like, your comments are like, I love all of you guys. Like, I wish I could answer, to, but I work. Too, and much so respect really for those people, the parents. Much respect for all of them. It, but it, look, at the end of the day, it takes two parents. Two parents. One parent can pull through with it, be a mom and dad, 
or dad and mom or whatever, you know. <clears throat> but, you know, at the end of the day, someone always gets hurt. If it's not your, it's your wife, your husband, it's going to be the kids, your family. Well, look, what I want to say is like on one of our prior videos that we did, I think it was like on Britney's, talking about Britney's pregnancy. I read this comment um, that this female put on my, on, on, left on our comment, and it said, my dad raised all of us. It, it, like, I don't know what the reason was for the mom not to be there. Because, you know, it's it's hard for a woman to raise kids, so I can only imagine for a father. So, like, all my respects to those single and dads. And all my respects that, for all the parents, the single parents, the single moms, but it's the hard single dads single that are raising kids. Too. You know, all much love and much respect. And, um, but at the end of the day, uh, why do people cheat? I have no idea. I don't know why people cheat. I think cheat. he does. I think that he, uh, basically that was, I wanted to get him to answer that question. I can't tell you why. He's I, a guy, so he, he I cheated can't tell so he should you. know. And I feel like you're saying I can't you tell you bored. why I... Why I feel like you're trying to say you get bored and you just can't stick to one woman. No, I can't tell you why I cheated true. because I never cheated. Well, I sort of got a, I, I never like, did, Marvie. Like, calm down, whatever. You but, thought I did, but so, I never did. And there'll be, we'll, we'll talk about this a little bit more. But don't because you forget. know, there's guys that are liars that they just don't want to admit to what they do, and you like video after video after video, and they never want to admit what they do. I mean, how can I get a straight answer from somebody that is a guy and that can't even admit to cheating? Guys, if there's any guys out there that cheated on their wives, I need some answers. Let me know. No, he's gonna tell you, don't admit to it. Or women and if they catch you in bed, don't admit to the cheating. No, you oh, always oh. say no. You know where he got that stupid shit from? My dad. That's why he says that. My dad told him. Yeah, so my dad. So you're saying your dad used to cheat? Yeah, hell yeah, my dad used to cheat on my mom all the time. Uh, watch, I'm gonna make a video on my mom. Man, I got so many videos for you coming up, but um, just my mom okay. and me because Ruben just You're has dead. to be defending all the guys. No, I dogs. defend women too. There's a lot of good women out there, and don't get me wrong, there's a lot of guys out but there. But you know that what? If you can, but you got in order to be a man, you have to com you have to be honest and you have to start admitting to your bad actions. I'm just saying that, and it, you gotta start it, fresh. Pretty much, exactly. Admit to what you did and own up to it. Be a man or okay, be a so woman. Then Wait, hold on. You guys gotta understand that. You know what? Ya no saben ni qué decir because all his excuses are lame. No. I don't even want answers no more because I know what he did. Like, you must be really stupid to catch your man talking to girls, getting pictures from girls naked, and. You're lying you because say, you know what? No, Back but in not, the days, but not in the iPhone. day. No, because look, okay, oh, oh motherfucker. You know what? It doesn't even have to do with that. But let's take it there, since you want to fucking be a liar. Okay, no. I didn't catch you with pictures. But you know what he did one time? He had a pager, because back then we used to use pagers. It's this little thing like this for the girl, new girl that doesn't know. It's a little thing like this, and then it would um, you know, it would beep or vibrate, and then it would have a number or code. And then one time, I don't know where he went, and he couldn't take his pager, so he hit the pager. And I kept texting him, and I would hear something go, zzz, zzz. So I paged and paged and paged and paged, and so I found it, and you hit the pager under the sofa. You hit the pager under the sofa, and you had, like, maybe, like, 30 messages, and they were coded. And I remember that one of the girl's name, I remember her name till the day, and I called her, and you met her, and you were talking to her. So I can go on and on and on and on. No, yeah, whatever. Just drink, whatever. You know what? You guys got any Ruben's more questions? A liar. If you guys got any more questions, hit us up. Let us know. We'll try to answer them the best we can, but what we live through. I lies. Mean, well, yeah, there might be a bunch of lies, but but look, we might be able to answer them as best by our experience. We are. She when is 42, up. and I'm 41. Shut the hell up! Why did you have to say that? This is why you always get mad. We are pretty experienced, so. We're doing on Truth or Shot. I want to ask you. I wanted to really throw in there what I don't like about you. What is it? I know this has nothing to do. This, has, this video was about one my cheek, but I really want to just tell you the way that I feel. <laughs> tell me. Let me know. So I want to tell you the way that I feel right now. 
because I'm going to forget. What? So this is my chance to tell you because then you're going to try to shut me up. Okay, and not tell wanna... me. One thing, and when we're talking about the video on truth or shock, and like I said, you want to know what I, I, I like about, what I don't like about you, da -da? and then we were already buzzing and I'm not buzzing right now, so I just want to tell you that what I don't like about you is that I don't like what I'm trying to tell the twins something, like if they're messing up or something's wrong, and you always go along with everything. And I'm trying to discipline them, and you're no baby girl, like. Meh. Okay, did, have I ever did that before in the past, or I'm doing it now? You're doing it now. And have I did it before? You're you've always been an alcahuete. To my kids. Yeah, like you just like let them do whatever, like whatever, and and, and I don't like that. And that's what I don't like about you. Like yes, you have a big heart, and that's why we're so like close because. We, me and him get mad all the this time, the and I hang I up on him. I hang up on him, I get mad, I'm like, bye. And then he'll just call me like 30 minutes later, Marvie, what are you doing? And I just let it go. Look, this That's is how the thing. we learn to get this along. Is That's the thing of, this is the thing of, I think about raising kids. I'm not saying I'm the best dad, or I'm a good dad, but my family's still in my life, my kids are still in my life, for a reason. There's a lot of kids that don't like their parents. But it doesn't matter, no. you have to discipline. Okay, it discipline. doesn't matter how old we are. And like, I discipline. They could be 50 years old, but if they're doing something wrong, you I have understand. to discipline. I well, understand, of course, yeah. I, of course, I never hit my kids. Never hit my kids. I don't Whatever, I have. I believe in spanking. Well, I, have I ever hit my kids? No, but that's why like, you just want to like, okay, let them do whatever. It's fine. Let Marbella be the bad person because I'm the one that disciplines. You have to discipline your I kids. I discipline my That's kids. That's going to be another topic. But uh, yeah, that'll That's be another, another topic. Video. Top, that'll be another topic. <laughs> how, to, how we raise our kids. How we raise no. the twins. Another topic is going to be about do you believe in spanking your kids and disciplining no, them? No, no, what no, age no, do you no. stop disciplining no, no, your no. kids? Forget about that. But we're going to talk about how we raised the twins and how they came out. I know they're not all there, but still, look. <laughs> Burn. But look, they're good girls, and my son is a good kid. Oh, yeah. So, I mean, after all the shit that we've been through, there's something a little bit good that but came out But I just feel like, I, you know what I, I think, really want to talk I about? Think. At what age do you, I feel like you still have to discipline your kids. It doesn't matter how old they no, are. You I'm always, their mom. You have to be their no, parent before they're their friend. Discipline their kids is different when they're at a certain age. I think... No, dales I, there's con, only so much I can do because they're si already old. Consejo, there's only so much bien. I can do because they're older they're already, already so that's got their own people have to understand it. Yes, there's only so much <clears throat> I can say, but you have to say it. And if they want to take your advice, fine. And if they don't, then... But I feel like you're not a cahuete. No, you want to see what I feel about <laughs> What? I feel that... Cut! And thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe down and post your notifications and hit the like button. And that wraps up another video.